Hi there, welcome to the new ClickSense tutorial video and in this video we will look at the very useful round function. So round function returns the resulting value rounded up or down to the nearest multiple step that we are specifying and it also has an offset which uh, is uh, optional. If you specify then it can increase or decrease the value based on the offset value that you are providing. So let's look at some of this very simple example. Uh, related to this. So for that I will add just one quick measure. So first of all I will write chr10 which will put the cursor or take this uh, function in the next line and then I will specify the function which is the round. So round in this you can specify the field so I will say 3.8 it will be rounded to the nearest value. So if I just click apply this is 4 right. If I just apply um, another round which is uh, R O U N D round and then 2 and 6 if I specify that means I want as I'm rounded down to 6 but let's say what's what is the output that we get but before that I will put this into a next line by specifying CHR 10 and click apply so what, what we get is 0 and we get 0 because it's less than half of the step interval of 6. So whenever you have a scenario and you get 0, you should know that if it is less than the half of the step interval of 6, then it will be 0. All right. So similarly, you have a lot of options like I will just show you the offset option. So in the expression editor, I will simply like round 1.1 to 1. So it will be rounded off up until 1 and I will provide an offset 0.5 that means if uh, it is the nearest one is like 0.5 then 1.1 will change to 1.5. So if I just click apply it will be 1.5 as you would see. So this is how you will going to utilize or you will going to specify the round function for your field values or the static value whatever is your requirement you can specify either static value or field value to get the desired output. But that's about it and I'll meet you in the new video with the new topic.